Anti-pandemic battle. One day, Jim was playing at home and knocked over a cup. Mary was infuriated. What's wrong with you, Jim? Did I tell you to be careful when playing at home? You make such a mess every time. Ugh. Gosh. Look what you've done. You make my stomach ache and chest so stuffy. Stop crying. Go tidy up this place and let me take a rest. Mary is emotionally unstable due to the pandemic. Her child's mistake was the final straw. So what's happening to Mary's body? Oh no, oh no, I'm really timid. When Mary gets angry, I get twisted up like this. <gasps> what's happening? Uh, the village is breathless. The air will come up. Oh my god, all the blood vessels are constricted. Oxygen and nutrients cannot be delivered to the heart. Mary's heart, are you okay? When Mary gets angry, I feel dizzy. Why am I so emotionally unstable? <sighs> the wisdom of our ancestors says... Yellow Emperor's Canon of Medicine. The heart is like the king of a country. It controls the various organs of the body, coordinating and cooperating with each other. The brain is in charge of processing information and transmits correct information to the organs. Many illnesses are caused by negative emotions. Jim! When you are happy, she and blood will flow smoothly. Jim! According to the World Health Organization, 90% of diseases are related to emotions. The negative emotions mess up the immune system. The new coronavirus has forced the life we know to change. Everyone's mood has become quite unstable, allowing the virus to take advantage of it. Come on, let us learn how to control our temper. Always face everything with a positive attitude. Let's watch it again. The same scenario, but with Mary having a positive mindset. She'll lose my temper. Take a deep breath and speak gently. Jim, be careful when you're playing, all right? Go and wipe the water up. Whoa, Mom, you're so pretty when you're not angry. Good temper. Good energy. Good health, meow. No worries, Arf. Breathe deeply and evenly every day. Fill up with energy. Don't be nervous. Absorb well, digest well. No anger for good detox, immunity, and metabolism. Be happy and immune cells will unite. Heart and brain work together to bring harmony and vigor to the body and mind. Being calm and good temper will refresh our energy and increase our wisdom. <laughs> our heart is also a conscience. Use your conscience to do good things. Gratitude and contentment create more happiness hormones, improve immunity, and create a super protective shield that protects the balance of the body and mind. Anti-pandemic battle. Let's follow the three don'ts, five do's, and six tips. The coronavirus has changed the life of all human beings in the entire world. Its mutation speed is quite fast. We don't need to panic, but we must protect ourselves internally and externally to strengthen the immunity of our body, mind, and spirit. Come on, let's remind each other to follow the guidelines of the three don'ts, five do's, and six tips. The three don'ts. Don't be anxious, don't worry, and don't lose your temper. Five do's are wash your hands more often, drink more warm water, do more exercises, be happy, and be more careful. The other six tips are wash your hands frequently, wear face masks, practice social distancing, avoid touching your eyes, nose, and mouth. Increase your lung capacity through breathing exercises and maintain a positive mindset. In our fight against the pandemic, 
we should uphold our conscience and honesty. Let's work together. Hopefully the pandemic will be over soon so that we can return to our normal life.